welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm going to show you guys how i did these beautiful corn rolls with just yen and needles i don't know if i pronounce that yen well or you can say thread and needles or you can call it wool and needles or you can call it knitting thread and needles it has a lot of names anyways so i parted my hair in two halves and put the back part away So this is the thread and the needle I'm going to be using for the corn rolls. When you put the wool through the needle, make sure that one part is longer than the other. So I did two off camera because it was my first time trying this out and I wanted to be sure that I could do it. So I applied air gel to make each corn look neat. So after applying the gel, I try to hold my hair and twist, twist it a bit and pass the needle through just like this and pull the thread out, not all the way out. So the part of the thread I didn't pull out, I put it in the hair and twist it with the hair and then I start to pass the needle through the hair. I don't actually know if that makes sense but if you watch closely you would see what i'm trying to explain so you know how you stitch your dress at home with needle and thread is the same way it's pretty simple So I did this until I got to the end. So when I got to the end, I cut the, the bow and I start to thread my hair and then I tied it. So I actually repeated the process for all the corn rolls. So I'm not going to speed up the video so you guys would understand what I was trying to explain earlier. Make sure the needles you're using are new or make sure that they are sterilized because there will be a lot of putting in the mouth to avoid stories that touch.
so guys i look so tired because i filmed this at about 1 a.m so forgive whatever is going on in my face and focus on the style we are about to create okay so watch and the blessed sister
So when I finished with the corn roll, I sprayed water on my hair and put everything in a bun. So guys, I incorporated this video of the hair I used because I didn't have a picture and because the hair is not new, I've used it before in one of my previous videos. So I attached it to my bun with a rubber band and wrapped it around my hair to form a big bun. And then I used um, bobby pins to hold the parts that are hanging out. Then I put hair jewelries and voila! I hope you enjoyed watching. Please don't forget to click on the subscribe button so you miss out on any new videos.